Hi, I'm Bobby McFerrin, and welcome to a presentation of The Wizard of Oz like nothing you've ever seen or heard before. I've been telling stories to my kids from the time they could talk. Come on, Daddy, come on, Daddy, tell us a story, please, please. And The Wizard of Oz was one of my specialties, with me doing all the voices, of course. I got you, my pretty. <laughs> you know that. Step forward, Tin Man. Oh, oh, Toto, I have a feeling we're not in Kansas anymore. I'm getting ahead of myself. Anyhow, the more times I told the story, the more I realized what a great adventure it really was. An adventure we're all going to share tonight as we take an amazing skating journey over the rainbow. The Wizard of Oz on Ice. Starring 1994 Olympic gold medalist Oksana Bayou and 1992 Olympic gold medal champion Victor Petrenko as the Scarecrow. With a special appearance by Canadian and world professional champions Paul Martini and Barbara Underhill. Featuring the singing sensation Shanice. And also starring 10-time Grammy winner Bobby McFerrin as your host and the voice of just about everybody. Join Dorothy as she travels to a wondrous world of color and enchantment, where the Good Witch of the North sends her on a journey through the land of odds. Along the way, Dorothy is joined by a scarecrow a tin man, and a cowardly lion who are each searching for something only the great and powerful Wizard of Oz can provide. Tonight on The Wizard of Oz on Ice. You remember how it began, don't you? It was summer in Kansas. There on a farm lived a lovely young lady named Dorothy Gale. Well, seems like her dog Toto had chased after a cat belonging to the mean old Miss Gulch. But when Dorothy tried to tell her Aunt Em and the others what happened, they were all too busy to pay her much mind. Aunt Em had to be pretty forceful. Dorothy, please, just find yourself a place where you won't get into any trouble. And Dorothy wondered if there really was such a place, a place where you could escape from all your cares. Some day I wish upon 
It was a beautiful dream, but it didn't last long, because who should come riding up the drive but that nasty Miss Gulch herself? <laughs> She's really steamed up, complaining the Toto bitter. And despite Dorothy's pleading, Uncle Henry sadly puts Toto in the basket. Off rides, Miss Gulch. Toto escapes and runs back to Dorothy, who realizes they'd better run away quick before Miss Gulch returns. However, Mother Nature has other plans in the form of one of those calamitous Kansas twisters bearing down on Dorothy's farm. The twister is over. The house has landed. But the question is, where? This Smithsonian Minute is brought to you by Discover Card, proud partner of the Smithsonian's 150th anniversary. Judy Garland wore these magical shoes as Dorothy in the 1939 MGM classic movie, The Wizard of Oz. Several pairs were created for the actress to walk in, skip in, and click together. The original script describes a pair of silver slippers, but during the filming they were changed to ruby. Who wrote the book The Wizard of Oz, and what was Dorothy's last name? The Smithsonian Minute Answer, after this. In the world of credit cards, the traffic is getting pretty heavy. 
but Discover Card keeps you in control. With the Cashback Bonus Award, the Smart Rate Program, and no annual fee. For a positive impact on your finances, it pays to Discover. The Oz books were written by L. Frank Baum. The courageous girl who was lifted from Kansas was named Dorothy Gale. I'm Tricia Yearwood. The Smithsonian Institution, celebrating 150 years. Come into Subway and get two freshly made tuna sandwiches for just $3. Or go to those other places and get... two freshly made six-inch tuna subs for $3. For a limited time, it's Subway. Bayer, powerful pain relief and so much more. These days, more and more people are doing things they never imagined before. People who never imagined a minivan could drive like a car are driving the Mercury Villager. People who never imagined how much fun driving could be are driving the Mercury Mystique. And people who never imagined a car could look and feel this solid are driving the all-new Mercury Sable. Imagine yourself in a Mercury. Now get 4.8% financing on all 96 Mercuries. No victim, no evidence. It'll be the first time. Was there ever a murder more mysterious? He's still alive. You solved this one. Murder, She Wrote Thursday. On America's Night of Television, a daughter falls in with the wrong crowd. Don't you trust me? You weren't with Becky. How far will she go to fit in? <laughs> Dr. Quinn, then, an addicted cop. You need help. Puts an angel in a line of fire. Officer down, officer down. Touched by an angel after Dr. Quinn on CBS Saturday. She may be the new kid. Looks great. I like the tie. Right. Very don't, nice. Don't, don't, oh. But she already knows her way around. Isn't it cute? Where'd you get it? Muppet Palace? Bonnie premieres Sunday, March 10th, after Sybil. Dennis Hopper, tonight on The Late Show with David Letterman. Dorothy can't believe her eyes, the shapes, the colors. Toto, I have a feeling we're not in Kansas anymore. We must be over the rainbow. Glinda. The Good Witch of the North welcomes Dorothy to Munchkinland and shows how her falling house crushed all that remains of the Wicked Witch of the East. Then she summons all the Munchkins to come out and celebrate Dorothy's good deed. Let the joyous news be spread. The Wicked Old Witch at last is dead. In the county of the land of Oz, I welcome you most regally, but we've got to verify it legally. As coroner, I must defer, I thoroughly examine her, and she's not only merely that she's really most sincerely dead.
comes back, apologizing. No, no, it was an accident. But Glinda reminds the witch. Aren't you forgetting the ruby slippers? The slippers? Yes, the slippers! They're gone! The ruby slippers! What have you done with them? Give them back to me, all right? It's too late. There they are, and there they'll stay. Very well. I'll bide my time. I'll get you, my pretty, and your little dog, too. <laughs> Looks like Dorothy has made rather a bad enemy of the Wicked Witch of the West. So Glinda advises her to get out of Oz altogether and look up the only one who can help her leave, the great and powerful Wizard of Oz himself. And to find him, all Dorothy must do is follow the yellow brick road. Yellow Brick Road. Follow the 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 Yellow Brick Road. So, Dorothy is on her way down the yellow brick road when she suddenly meets a scarecrow. A not too happy scarecrow because, you see, it's very tedious being stuck up here all day with a pole up your back. Naturally, Dorothy helps him down, sort of, and discovers that her new friend would be much happier if his head weren't filled with straw. And instead, if he only had a brain. Why, there'd be so many things he could do. I could while away the hours, conferring with the flowers, consulting with the rain. In my head, I'd be scratching while my thoughts were busy hatching if I only had a brain. I'd unravel every riddle for any individual in trouble or in pain. With the thought, I'd be thinking I could be another Lincoln if I only had a brain. Oh, I could tell you why The ocean's near the shore I could think of things I never thought before And then I'd sit and think some more I would not be just a nothing My head all full of stuffing My heart all full of pain I would dance and be merry Life would be a ding a dairy If I only had a brain It would be awful pleasing to reason out the reason for things I can't explain. Then perhaps I'll deserve you and be even worthy for you 
It doesn't take Dorothy long to realize that if the great Wizard of Oz could help her get home to Kansas, he could certainly help the Scarecrow get a brain. We're off to see the wizard, the wonderful Wizard of Oz. We hear he is the wizard of a wizard, if ever a wizard there was. And off they go together down the yellow brick road. Suddenly, they come upon a man. A man made out of tin. All rusted up from being left out in the woods. there's an oil can right nearby. And in no time, the Tin Man is telling his new friends what he could do if his insides weren't all hollow. When a man's an empty cat, he should be on his metal and yet i torn apart. Just because I'm presuming that I could be kind of human if I only had a heart. Picture me balcony above a voice sings low wherefore art thou Romeo I hear a beat <laughs> how sweet Well, if the wizard can give Scarecrow a brain, it seems likely he could give Tin Man a heart as well. So all three start off once again to see the great Oz. We're off to see the wizard, the wonderful wizard of Oz. And before long, they find themselves in a dark, creepy forest that the Tin Man warns may be filled with wild animals like lions, tigers, and bears. Oh my, lions and tigers 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 and bears. Oh my, lions
Come on! Because of the wonderful things he does. We're off to see the wizard, the wonderful wizard of Oz. Oh, yeah. These are looking up for our heroes. The Wicked Witch of the West is looking out for those ruby slippers, so... Don't go far, my pretties! Don't go far! <laughs> Come on, honey. Come on. That's my big boy. Good. There you go. Mommy's gonna put you in your high chair and fix you some Edie's cookies and cream. Wow! Edie's. Evidently, it's not your normal ice cream. The ultimate shrimp. Gigantic. It's just ever so tender. Juicy. Juicy and juicy. All I want is jumbo. You want it? Red Lobster's got it. Introducing the Jumbo Tiger Prawn. The biggest and best tasting shrimp we've ever served. So juicy, so tender. It's premium shrimp. The Jumbo Tiger Prawn at Red Lobster. Awesome. Can I have my shrimp, please? Right now, you can enjoy the Jumbo Tiger Prawn feast at a special introductory price. I'm starved. Let's eat. Come on. Ever notice what some people put in their Ziploc and only Ziploc brand freezer bags? Dinner for the boss. The new record! First date from Mr. Daredevil. Seems a lot of people put important stuff only in freezer bags from Ziploc. That's because we put in tough, super thick plastic. Whoa! And the new clicking zipper. You can feel clothes to lock out freezer burn in five perfect sizes. A wedding day. Ziploc with the new clicking zipper. Monostat 7 has something that makes treating a yeast infection easier. Convenient, pre-filled applicators, so there's less mess. I always knew there was no better cure. Now there's no easier one. Monostat, the number one choice of women, the number one recommendation of doctors. Why didn't you see a doctor sooner? Dad's stomach was always bothering him. But the doctor had good news. The doctor said Mylanta. For heartburn and acid indigestion, doctors recommend Mylanta most. My doctor said Mylanta. See the world's hottest female vocalists on music's biggest night. Join host Ellen DeGeneres to see who will win it all for best female pop vocalist. Mariah Carey, Joan Osborne, Bonnie Raitt, Vanessa Williams, Dion Ferris, or Annie Lennox. The 38th Annual Grammy Awards, Wednesday on CBS. Taking part in supervised athletics can reduce a kid's involvement in violence by teaching sportsmanship, teamwork, and positive communication. Dorothy and her three new friends are on their way to the Emerald City to see the Wizard of Oz. But that wicked witch is keeping track of the vinegar snowball. <laughs> and making plans to get hold of those magical ruby slippers. Yes! Yes! And now, my beauties, something with poison in it, I think. Poppies! Poppies!
As our heroes come into the poppy field, the wicked witch casts her evil spell. <laughs> the poison poppies have worked their spell. <laughs> but Glinda, the good witch of the north, has a plan to save our heroes by making the poppies wilt under a blanket of snow. Heroes wake up and find themselves at the gates to the Emerald City. Home of the Wizard of Oz. Circling above them, Dorothy and her friends need to see the great Wizard of Oz now more than ever. From Walt Disney Pictures. Run for your lives! Chance, Sassy, and Shadow are back. Look out, coming through. But this time, they're trading the wide open spaces. Ah! Typical canine. For the dog-eat-dog <laughs> world of the big city. It doesn't look like our backyard. Go to it, Pete. I'm on it, boss. It's Kung Fu Kitty. Ow, ow, ow. Homeward Bound 2, Lost in San Francisco. This is gonna be good. <laughs> Rated G. Starts Friday, March 8th at a theater near you. Can you be new? You can if you rush to the Fashion Casual Sale at Payless. Right now, the looks you want for a new you start as low as $9.99. Spend as little as $12.99, and you'll feel splendid. Aren't these just you? The Fashion Casual Sale at Payless. Doesn't it feel good to pay less? Why does your grilled cheese taste so good? Because I invented it. Daddy. I couldn't have done it without Kraft Singles. So warm and crispy. Even the president wanted a taste. Last time it was the cream. For great grilled cheese, taste the magic Kraft Singles make. The Wizard of Oz on Ice will continue. Tonight, Captain Comeback, as you've never seen him before. It's tough, I think, for anybody to live a Christian lifestyle. Jim Harbaugh, from life in the NFL to his faith. 
think I just answered that knocking. Join Wish TV's Debbie Knox for this rare one-on-one. -on -one. I've felt a lot of blessings. Tonight at 11, only on 24-Hour News 8. Tomorrow on Daybreak Live, we'll show you some dogs who won a contest by doing some most unusual tricks. We'll tell you about the two-tiered approach to getting in shape, diet, and exercise. Join us. You're on CBS. Around Indiana, there's a tradition that's old and beloved. It's your Indiana Four Dealers Inventory Tax Clearance. Your chance to get 4.8 APR financing on virtually every new Ford in stock. And only your Ford dealer has five of the ten best-selling cars and trucks in America. There's a great selection to choose from. And with low 4.8 financing, it's easy to score a winning deal. It's the Inventory Tax Clearance, and your Indiana Ford dealer's the one to see. One strikes from underground, one attacks from the air, one is the newest, most destructive of all. But every one can be stopped by the exterminator, the Orkin Man. Whichever invader you have, his advanced technology will destroy them. Then with the Orkin foam system, he lays down a barrier to keep termites from ever returning. Guaranteed. Call the exterminator, day or night, at 1-800-800-ORKIN. One call destroys them all. Concern over hepatitis closes the salad bars at three Indiana schools tonight. Dorothy and her friends cautiously enter the wizard's throne room when suddenly... I am Oz, the great and powerful. Who are you? Oh, look at that. Look at that. Oh, oh. I want to go home. I want to go home. One by one, the awesome wizard confronts each of our terrified heroes, having a particularly dramatic effect on the cowardly lion. Oh! Surprisingly, the wizard eventually agrees to grant each of their requests. A brain for the scarecrow, a heart for the tin man, courage for the lion, and home for Dorothy. But there is one little catch. Bring me the broomstick of a witch of the West. But, 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 what if she... I said, bring me her broomstick. Now go! Unfortunately, the only way to get the witch's broomstick is to pass through the haunted forest, home of the jitterbugs. Are you all right? I don't believe in spooks. I don't believe in spooks. I don't believe in spooks. You'll believe in a lot more than that when I finish with you. Got the jitter, scarecrow? Well, how about a few jitterbugs to make you all a little jittery? <laughs> Whoa! Did you just hear what I just heard? That voice don't come from no ordinary voice. It may be just a cricket or a cricket in the trees. It's kidding me the jitters. It joins around my knees. I haven't got a heart, but I got a palpitation. As monarch of the forest, I don't like the situation. It's a who's it? It's a who's it? It's a what's it? What's a what's it? Who's that? What's that? Who's that? Who's that hiding in the treetops? It's the rascal, the jitterbug. Should you catch him buzzing round you, keep away from the jitterbug. Oh, the bats and the bees and the breeze in the trees have a terrible, horrible buzz. But the bats and the bees and the breeze in the trees could do what the jitterbug does. So be careful of that rascal and keep away from the jitterbug. Oh, the bats 
and the bees and the breeze and the trees have a terrible, horrible buzz. But the bats and the bees and the breeze and the trees couldn't do what the jitterbug does. So be careful of that rascal. Keep away from the jitterbug. The jitterbug. The jitterbug. With our heroes exhausted from their encounter with the jitterbugs, evil monkeys swoop down, capture Dorothy, and carry her away. Meanwhile, Dorothy's three friends are now too weak to resist the monkeys and are unable to save her. So Dorothy finds herself a prisoner in the witch's castle, waiting helplessly as the witch pronounces her sentence. Do you see that? That's how much longer you've got to be alive. And it isn't long, my pretty. The sands of time are running out, and escape seems impossible, for the witch's castle is surrounded by her evil guards. escaped and leads Dorothy's friends to the witch's castle. Scarecrow, Tin Man, and Lion devise a plan to enter the witch's castle by disguising themselves as guards. this a hair color that's a cream excellence cream excellence doesn't drip it even protects and it really covers gray does your hair color do all that excellence cream by l'oreal think about it it's never fun to eat and run to rush and eat too fast because you know it's gonna catch up with you at last for acid indigestion or heartburn with headache nothing's faster than alka-seltzer get yourself some alka-seltzer and you'll feel better fast what makes Lubriderm different? Clean moisture. The kind that's water-based, not oil-based. So it helps protect from dryness without feeling greasy. It's no wonder dermatologists recommend Lubriderm more than any other leading lotion. The clean moisture of Lubriderm. See you later, alligator. And to exfoliate and moisturize, consider Lubriderm with alpha hydroxy. She doesn't like doors. Her sleepy eyes mean I trust you. She can be easily embarrassed. Whiskas has discovered many of the secrets about what cats want and need. So we make sure your cat gets our unique recipe with over 40 nutrients, along with an irresistible taste she loves. What makes her purr? The secret is Whiskas. And you. One with my Pizza Hut Rawlings game ball. I am a human highlight film. I Yo, hurry up. am awesome. Come on. 
But I ate the whole pizza that comes with the ball. So I Stink. am incredibly slow. I'm leaving. The Game Ball, $4.99 with any pizza. Keep the ball, share the pizza. Fool, you'll love the stuff we're made of. No victim, no evidence. It'll be the first time. Was there ever a murder more mysterious? He's still alive. You solved this one. Murder, She Wrote, Thursday. It is a fairy tale love story. We met when we were children. Their love took them all the way to the Olympic gold. They were brilliant together. He was taken too soon. Join us as we skate for them. And she makes her first public appearance as a solo skater. Sergei Grinkoff, a celebration of a life. Dorothy is a prisoner in the castle of the Wicked Witch. But the Scarecrow, Tin Man, and Lion are determined to help their new friend. With a display of courage and heart and brains, they bring off a daring rescue, just as the hourglass runs out. But their attempt is foiled by the appearance of the witch with her guards and monkeys. A wild chase follows, and our heroes are captured in a ring of spears. Wicked Witch gloats, for the ruby slippers will be hers as soon as Dorothy is dead. But first, she forces Dorothy to watch as she sets about to destroy her three friends one at a time. She cannot bear to see her friend in agony, so she breaks free and grabs a bucket to douse the fire, but hits the witch instead. Oh, you cursed brat! Look what you've done! I'm melting, melting! Oh, what a world, what a world! Oh, look out, look out! I'm going, going! Oh! It was all over. Almost. Dorothy and her friends got the broom, raced back to the Emerald City. But another surprise awaited them. The great wizard received the broom, but refused to grant their wishes. And as he talked, Toto went to the throne and pulled down part of the curtain. Pay no attention to that man behind the curtain. The great Oz has spoken. Oh. I am the great and powerful wizard of Oz. Oh, don't say it. Yes, I know. I'm, I'm a humbug. Yes, I remember my promises. A heart for the tin man, courage for the cowardly lion, and a brain for Scarecrow. Well, anyone can have a brain. But they have one thing you haven't got, a diploma. And back where I come from, we have folks who are called heroes. And they have one thing you haven't got, a medal. And as for you, my galvanized friend, you want a heart. Therefore, I take pleasure in presenting you with a small token of our esteem and affection. And Dorothy, my dear child, even your dreams can come true. Though the only way to get you back to Kansas is to take you there myself. No, no, child, you need not doubt me. I'm an old Kansas man myself. Premier balloonist in the Miracle Wonderland Carnival Company. And in that balloon, you and I will return to the land of E Pluribus Uno. <laughs> As Toto runs to say goodbye to their new friends, Dorothy rushes down to catch him. 
but the balloon lifts off without them. The balloon is leaving, and the wizard can't do anything to stop it, because he doesn't know how the thing works. All I can do is bid Oz and Dorothy a fond farewell. Well, there she was, stuck in Oz forever. Or was she, fearing she would never see her beloved Aunt Em and Uncle Henry again? Dorothy sadly turned and was surprised to see Glinda, the good witch of the North, who told her, You've always had the power to go back to Kansas simply by using your ruby slippers and clicking your heels together three times. But now Dorothy realized once she did that, she would be leaving her three new friends forever. Everyone was very sad. Now I know I've got a heart, because it's breaking. You know, I would never have found my courage if it hadn't been for you. And Dorothy realizes she will miss the Scarecrow most of all. Dorothy clicks her heels together three times and thinks to herself, There's no place like home. There's no place like home. There's, no like There's no place like home. There's no place like home. There's no place like home. To purchase a video cassette copy of tonight's special program, The Wizard of Oz on Ice, please call 1-800-762-9990. The price is just $19.98 plus $3.95 for shipping and handling. The special edition is only available by calling 1-800-762-9990. Call now. Claritin. It's time. It's time. Don't wait another minute for Claritin. Claritin. I'll ask my doctor. It's time to see your doctor. Mr. Wilkin, the doctor will see you now. At last, a clear day is here. I want to know more about Claritin. Doctor yes, ask your doctor for a trial of Claritin. For free information and a $5 coupon toward a prescription for Claritin, call 1-800-CLARITIN. Kids don't always take good nutrition seriously, but moms know it's important for growing up healthy. That's why Flintstones has the vitamins and minerals kids need and the great taste they love. Come into Subway and get two freshly made tuna sandwiches for just $3. Or go to those other places and get two freshly made six-inch tuna subs for $3. For a limited time, it's Subway. 
Thursday, a desperate man threatens suicide. This man was going to jump. Can three strangers save him before tragedy strikes? Rescue 911. Then, on 48 Hours, were these kids abused? Do you hurt anywhere? Do you have a boo-boo? What happened next may surprise you. Rescue 911, 48 Hours, Thursday. The great adventure ends, and Dorothy returns to her friends and family in Kansas. And while they may think her tales of Oz are merely dreams from a bump on the head, to Dorothy, her journey over the rainbow will always be as real as real can be. Of course, everyone lived happily ever after. And Dorothy learned that if you ever go looking for your heart's desire, you don't have to look any further than your own backyard, because there's no place like home.